What's up everyone, today I'm going to show you how to make your own modded Minecraft mod pack using CurseForge from CurseForge.com. You're going to want to go ahead and download that off their website using the correct bottom standalone link and then install. It's very easy, it's just hitting accept the agreement and hit install and it's going to work through that on its own for you. Once that's done, it'll open up the program. You just want to find Minecraft in there and just open that up. Now in the top right corner, we see that create custom profile. We're going to hit that, give our profile just a random name, whatever you want to call your mod pack. Select your version. Right now, 119.2 is pretty good for modding. Then you want to select your, your mod type. I'm going with Forge and it automatically selects the most recent version. I have this profile created. You can hit this button in the top right to add more content. This is going to be where you find your list of mods. It's going to have the most popular ones. You can search at the top. I'm just going through scrolling and finding a quick one. You can click on them, learn more if you want. You can spend hours scrolling and finding different mods. I'm adding this one and we see that it added its library mod automatically, which is a really nice feature. I went ahead and added a few more mods and tried to launch it. We're just going to take this for a test run before we send it to any friends or anything. And we can see it is launching very slowly. This is sped up a huge amount. Your first time launching any mod pack will be slow. That's to be expected. It's just the nature of all those mods interacting for the first time and creating their folders. Don't stress out. That won't be the case every single time. Now we're just going to load up a test world in creative with cheats on. You'll have that one warning letting you know that there's experimental features. Just say it's fine and go ahead. Your world will also, once again, take a while to load. Uh, this is sped up a huge amount. My computer is not that fast. But once it's done, you want to get in that world and just find a way to test that all the mods are working. That's why I really love Creative for this. You can just open up that menu, find any indicator that your mods are in there and just play around with it for a bit and go absolutely crazy. In this case, see me open it up. I see the mob mod in here where I can spawn orcas. And that's my indicator that I did have a successful launch of the pack. Now that's all there is to it. You've created your first mod pack. Congratulations. I hope you really enjoy playing around with this. Let me know what sort of guides you want to see next. And thank you so much for watching.